What's up, everyone? It's Brandino, the car guy. Um, I just want to do a quick little intro. This is the first time that the camera's actually looking at my ugly mug. Um, got a little fresh little cut. Looking a little scruffy on the, on the shave. But um, I wanted to just start off with just a little intro. Um, so I am actually sitting on my Q4. I'm currently getting charged. Um, and a great idea popped into my head. Hey, let's make a video. Let me show you guys how to use Electrify America. So after this intro, I'm going to have a little screen record with a little voiceover, basically going over everything in your um, app, where to go to and how to redeem your free Audi credits. Okay. If you don't have free Audi credits, you will easily use your Electrify America app, download the app, create an account, sign up for the free pass, um, load some money on there um, and use that if you don't have free credits, okay? Um, there is another part of this video where I'll show you where to tap that. Uh, you can actually add it to your Apple wallet and then you can tap it on the Electrify America machine itself. So um, without further ado, blah, 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 blah. cannot talk, <laughs> but without further ado, I am going to transition you on over to that screen record um, and I'll show you how to start a charging session. If you have questions, you have concerns, leave them down in the comments. Please like, subscribe. Let's go check it out. Hopefully this video will save you from being stranded and make sure that you use your free credits because on Q4s, you get 250 kilowatt hours, which is about equivalent to about five to six charging, eh, maybe five to seven charging um, sessions. Um, and then on e-tron GT and Q8 e-tron, you're gonna get about, I believe, two years of free charging as well um so um again hopefully this video is helpful and let's go check out that screen record and how to start your charging session through your my audi app okay all right guys all right so now i have my my audi app open you'll see my audi q4 each right at the top uh, charge level on the left mileage on the right You'll see charging climate control let's scroll down a little bit more we're gonna hit energy usage this is where you'll actually see where uh, how much charging credits you have so i'm going to hit this bad boy we're going to wait for this to load on up then once it loads this is going to show your kilowatts left um for your free charging again q4 e charging gets 250 kilowatt hours which equates to five to seven charging sessions sessions and e-tron gt and q8 gets two years so uh, now after that, I'm going to hit start charger. This is where we want to go to start a charging session. We're going to wait for this to load. And then once this loads, you'll see quick tips here. So I actually can give you step one, two, and three in regards to what you need to do. Then the box will pop up. Then you'll type in your charger ID, which is a long number with a dash and then your charger number at the end. So we'll type that in. Boom, boom. Then we're going to hit start charging. Once we hit start charging, it's gonna then think. So it's gonna find the station that you're parked at. Again, you can either plug your car in first or plug it in after you start your charging session. I find more um, success with connecting the charger after. So now connecting the charger, it's thinking, yada, yada. So um, this here is the only way it will redeem your free credits. If you run out of credits, you do not do charging session this way. But let's go over to the charging station now. So now if I come over to the screen, it'll say, please plug in. You'll also notice the 1-800 number here and station ID. So let's go ahead and get this plugged in. So we'll grab that. We'll remove my little guy there. And then we'll plug her in. This will start flashing wipe. Okay. And then once it's accepted the charge, you'll see that this is initiating. Sorry for the glare there. It's starting to make a bunch of noises still green on the q4 this will go green once this starts revving up here now it is going green okay just a couple of things here real quick on the electrify america station so it will show if you have free charging um of course you won't pay anything but you'll see 56 cents um per kilowatt hour they also updated the um, nomenclature as well. So you have 50, you have ultra fast, which is 150, has the two little lightning bolts. And then you'll also have 350, which is the ultra fast charger. Not very many um, vehicles that do have the infrastructure for the 350. There's a couple vehicles out there. A um, couple things when traveling, 
I always recommend download the Electrify America app um, and create an account, add your credit card, um, sign up for the free plan, make sure you have money loaded on there, and then you would just add your um, card to your Apple wallet or your, um, your wallet on your phone, um, and then you can just tap it there or you can also use a credit card there. Okay, so I'm gonna go into my Q4, I'll show you where it's gonna show you where, um, how long it's gonna take to charge and how much, um, how much kilowatts you need here. So you'll see there, 39 kilowatt current charge speed. So another thing before I hop in the car, um, these vary based off of your location and temperature outside. So this is a 150, currently I'm only starting at 40 kilowatts. This tends to ramp up um, once it kind of gets all warmed up as well. You can stop a charger. You can also hit the help and view pricing there as well. Very tippy top left, charging time, charging cost, and how many kilowatts have been delivered to your EV. Okay, you'll also see 1-800 number and charger ID there. Of course, that's a little bit easier to see. But one other thing, this charger number seven, so whatever the number is at the end of the day, that, that long number there, is you just wanna look for that number. And then the last two digits will be your charging number. So really that's all you need to really look at. But uh, let's jump into the Q4 and um, I'll show you where on the Q4 where you can see your charging progress. All right, guys. So now I'm sitting in the driver's seat of my Q4. I just want to show you a couple things real quick. You'll see my charging progress right in here. It's going to tell me how long it takes to get to 80%. I, I do have my car um, set to 80% um, for state of charge. If you don't know where to go, I'll just show you that real quickly. You go to vehicle, then you go to charging. When you're in here, you're going to see, of course, charging progress. Since I'm plugged in, I can uh, stop the charge there as well but you'll notice the target here daily use and orange is long distance you can always hit the little toggle there as well and it will explain what that bad boy is okay i'm still using my ac um i can still use my car play um and whatnot you can sit in your car watch some videos if you got good reception and whatnot so just wanted to show you how to do this um on the audi ev um, hopefully that screen record at the beginning of this video is helpful showing you where to go um, and uh, um, explaining um, how to redeem your free credits. When you run out of free credits, um, you do not use the My Audi app. You would then use the Electrify America app. Um, so um, I just kind of wanted to break down the Electrify America station. I know it was very brief, but there's not a whole lot to it. Just wanted to kind of show you some key um, key things to look for when you come to a charging station. But um, I will skip forward to unplugging the car on the Q4. It's a little tricky. Um, and I'll just show you what to do when you're done charging your Audi Q4. In other vehicles, I'll explain the differences as well of other e-tron product, what you need to do to stop charging. All right, guys. So let's go check that out and we'll wrap up this video. All right, so we are back outside here. Car's done charging. I did want to mention something. I was helping someone next to me here and you do have an idle fee. So after 10 minutes, when you're done charging, you have to unplug it right away, okay? So um, this took about, I would say 30 minutes to charge my guy. So let's just unplug this. So with Q4, you got to unlock it. It's not a release. Usually for your Q8 e-tron, there's a button. And for your Porsches, there's also a button. That light will shut off. So. In this case, car's unlocked. I'm gonna just hit that button, pull it straight out, and we're ready to roll. All right, so just a little recap. 27 kilowatts hour, 33 minutes, 56. I didn't charge, pay anything because I got free charging, but 56 cents. Um, and then idle fee is 40 cents a minute, okay? So hopefully this video helps. Um, and yeah, so that's just a little Q4 charging sesh there. Really appreciate you guys. And we'll see you on the next ones. Please like, subscribe, and comment if you have any other questions, concerns. And boom, there she is. All right, see y'all later. Take it easy. Bye.